Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am literally in the rambliest, chattiest mood today. So I'm gonna try my hardest to get to the point with this video because you know one of those days where you've kind of been alone all day and you haven't really seen anyone and then you get the opportunity to talk and you just ramble on and on till the end of time. Well, that's literally how I'm feeling right now. So I'm just gonna take a moment to get myself together. Today I'm gonna be doing my spring essentials or my spring favorites, just basically a range of different things things across beauty some style things I have some jewelry stuff as well I have a recipe for you guys too so just like everything spring basically which is my favorite season and I probably say that about every season but it's been a year since the last spring so I feel like right now spring's my favorite season if that made any sense at all it probably probably didn't first product I'm gonna to talk to you guys about is the Olay Regenerous three-point day cream SPF 30 in winter the Sun rarely comes out in England in fact it doesn't actually come out at all plus I'm indoors all the time because it's probably raining when spring and summer roll around I love going outside I love going for long walks especially with my dog Duke and that is when I really really need the SPF on this is kind of like a two-in-one because it moisturizes your skin but it also has SPF 30 in it as well even even though I normally find moisturizers with SPF to be quite gloopy or thick, this one's really fast absorbing. It's quite light, it's not greasy at all. Really nice thin texture that sinks into the skin really, really fast. There's UVA and UVB broad spectrum protection in here, so it does really help protect your skin. And apparently up to 80% of premature skin aging comes from unprotected UV exposure. So this I find really easy because it's not an extra step in the morning that you need to remember. It's not like, oh, I forgot to put on my my SPF you literally just moisturize your skin and the SPF 30 is in there already I do find that I need to protect my skin from incidental UV exposure every day so this just really helps because like I mentioned it's a two-in-one it's really easy it's super quick to apply and it's a really nice hydrating moisturizer as well product number two is also from the same range it's the Olay Regenerist this is the night cream the other thing I forgot to mention is that this one has a pump so I find it really easy to just squirt out and apply whereas this night cream comes in a little pot the night cream obviously does have SPF in it but I do find it's really hydrating it has a much thicker consistency but I find it still has that smoothing effect over my skin that the Regenerous day cream has the last skincare item I wanted to mention is also from Olay it's the Regenerous luminous dark circle correcting eye swirl guys I saw this I can't remember whose video I saw this in I think it might have been flares and I was like that is so cute it literally has the little swirl in the middle it is a really illuminating formula it's really smoothing as well that's the one thing I find Olay skincare products are really really good at is smoothing over my skin but it has little light reflective particles in it and that really helps brighten up my under eyes again this sinks in super 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 quickly the one thing I can't stand is when I'm getting ready in the morning and I I'm in a rush so I slap on my skincare and then I need to wait for it to sink in before I can apply my makeup there's no waiting around with these guys they sink in super 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 quick the next product I wanted to mention is something new from Tarte now these are so so cool oh they really really excite me this is the Tarte lip sculptor so you get a lipstick on one side and a lip gloss on the other now I've never actually seen a lipstick and lip gloss in one it's such a simple concept but it just is so handy because sometimes I want that lip gloss look and sometimes I just want a lipstick and sometimes I want both like I'm just so fickle about my lip products and I just love that this is a two-in-one this is in the shade voltage next thing I wanted to talk about for spring I love using cream products especially when it gets quite hot or if I'm in a rush or if I just want a more natural look especially when the Sun's out makeup can look quite intense on the skin it can really the Sun can really make your makeup show that little bit that you just didn't want it to this is really good it's the L'Oreal infallible sculpt contouring palette I'm much paler right now so I'm using the lighter shade of the two but in the winter I was using the darker shade I don't even know how that works but anyway it's a cream to powder formula so you literally apply it on with a brush blend it in it's super quick it's super easy it looks really natural as well this is something new that I've been obsessed with it's the Vita Liberata body blur oh my gosh it's like this liquid cream formula it's a kind of bronzy color but it smooths over the skin and it illuminates at the same time it's just amazing I would recommend applying it with a mitt surprisingly it also doesn't actually get on your skin so if you're just looking for a little illuminating kind of skin livening like body skin livening product then check this out something new is a fragrance now there have been so many amazing luxury fragrance launches recently and I wrote about quite a few of them on my blog but this one wins for me it's the Tom Ford Soleil Blanc when it comes to like fresh fruity floral scents I'm never really a huge fan but 
Tom Ford has just made it like super, super, super sophisticated. I love the packaging as well. So on to style items. The first thing I had to bang on about, I know I've talked about this in two videos recently, but I have literally been wearing it every single day. It's this All Saints leather jacket. It is so gorgeous. The color is just perfect for me. It instantly livens my mood. There's something about this blush color that just makes such a difference to my mood as opposed to choosing a black or brown or gray jacket. It's just like an instant pick me up pink. It's so adorable. It's really, really surprisingly easy to wear actually. I do wear quite a few neutral colors. Like right now I'm just wearing a white top and some jeans and I just throw this over on the top of my outfit right now. The next thing I wanted to mention is reflective sunglasses. Now these are a spring summer essential for me. Can I just you guys the funniest thing about reflective sunglasses is that you know when you're speaking to someone you can actually tell that they're not looking at you they're looking at themselves in the reflection of your sunglasses which is it's honestly so entertaining to wear them and notice people just looking at themselves and like fixing their hair and like taking the lipstick off their teeth it's so funny to watch but anyway these are my two favorites right now the first ones are these ones from Ray-Ban which have blue lenses my sister has ones with pink lenses in them which are also really really cute and then the next one ones are my silver Dior So Reels, which I also love. The next one I had to tell you guys about because I've literally been wearing them every single day. And these are my white Keds. They're just like the easiest little cute trainers to throw on. They're not even trainers, I guess, that like you would describe them as plimsolls, but they're just so easy and cute to throw on. And I don't find them particularly bulky. My problem with a lot of trainers is they make me look like I have really large feet. And I don't have like that large feet, I guess, but I find when the trainers like elongate your feet and then I just end up looking like a clown. I don't know, maybe that's just like a weird complex that I have, but I like that these make my feet look really small and petite. <laughs> that's such a random thing to say, I know, but anyway, hey ho. The next one I wanted to tell you guys about was a new brand I am completely in love with called Wanderlust & Co. They're a jewelry brand and I'm loving these two bracelets I'm wearing right now. One is like a bangle and it has a knot in the middle and the other one is a bracelet that says salt water on it which I really love and I love pairing them together and I love the jingly noise can you guys hear that I just love the jingly noise of like hearing bracelets on my wrist <laughs> it really satisfies me if you guys haven't seen my what I eat in a day video I did recently it was a spring salad now this is my favorite easy salad recipe it looks really complicated it has quite a few different ingredients in it but I promise you I promise you it's not it's so easy it's super filling and it's really refreshing at the same time as well I never thought I'd describe I a salad is refreshing but the mango in there makes it really really refreshing and it has quite a bit of protein in there as well from the quinoa so it will help you keep you fuller for longer it gives you a lot of good fuel and so that is everything I hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope you guys enjoyed all my picks because I am super super passionate about them as you can tell I'm just rambling on and on here I hope you have a wonderful day please don't forget to subscribe and I will see you soon bye guys mm -hmm.